Hello students, let us see a very interesting question from the chapter permutations and combinations. Here question is in how many ways can one select a cricket team of 11 from 17 players. Okay? So, we have to take care of this requirement. We have to select 11 players from 17 players in which only 5 players are 5 players can ball if each cricket team of 11 must include exactly 4 ballers. So, in this a team of 17 players in this group of sorry not team in this group of 17 players how many can ball 5 5 players can ball and out of these 5 players we have to select 4 ballers because each team include exactly 4 ballers so first of all let us select 4 ballers out of 5 ballers okay number of ways of selecting four ballers from five ballers because in this group of 17 there are five players who can ball here ballers means players okay five players or five ballers how we can select it five c four out of five players who can ball we have to select four ballers in how many ways five c four ways rest you see here four players have been selected we have to make a team of 11 so, how many selection is remaining here? 7. So, now number of ways of selecting 7 players since 4 plus 7 is 11. So, team should have 11 players. That is why here 4 ballers have been selected remaining 7 we have to select from how many in total of 17 players there are 5 ballers. So, remaining are 17 minus 5 from 17 minus 5 is equal to 12 players 12 players ok in how many ways 12 C 5 ok. So, up to some part we have done this job remaining part will be done by this many ways. So, we have to multiply both of them to get the answer. Therefore, a number of ways of selecting 11 players from 17 is equal to 5 c 4 into 12 c 5. We can calculate it easily since 5 c 4 is equal to 5 factorial by 4 factorial into 5 minus 4 factorial. We have to use this formula here n c r is equal to n factorial by r factorial n minus r whole factorial. By that formula we can write 5 c 4 is equal to like this and 12 c 5 is 12 factorial divided by 5 factorial into 12 minus 5 factorial 12 minus 5 factorial and we have to now simplify it this is 5 factorial by 4 factorial into 1 factorial you know 1 factorial is 1 into here 12 factorial divided by 5 factorial into 7 factorial. So, this 4 factorial will be cancel out here uh, we will get 5 and similarly 7 factorial will be cancel out here. So, this is 8 into 9 into 10 into 11 into 12 you can understand it very easily and 5 factorial is 1 into 2 into 3 into 4 into 5. 
So, just you simplify it, you can do it very easily and after simplification the answer which you will get will be 3960. This is the answer, very simple question. Just you have to understand the concept of the question, what is the requirement, do it accordingly, do it carefully, we will get the result very easily. So, thank you very much for watching this video, keep watching these videos and enjoy mathematics learning. Thank you very much.